Mobile Police Department is the latest law enforcement agency cracking down on golf cart drivers who are taking their vehicles to the streets. The concern is the lack of proper equipment making them roadworthy as well as the age of people getting behind the wheel. NBC 15's Lisa Labrinyak with our story. In the last two years in Mobile County, golf carts have kind of become the move of the future. At least that's what City of Mobile's public safety director, Lawrence Batiste, says. But they're not all street legal. And the problem is growing, with the number of regular car accidents going up in the city, primarily fatalities. He's saying nothing good will come out of having non-street legal golf carts driving on the same roads as cars and trucks. The impact, again, uh, of a golf cart in, in one of the regular vehicles that you would see on automobiles that are on the street today, uh, I don't think the outcome of the impact of, of having an accident uh, will be as favorable for the individuals in a golf cart. Because of recent behavior involving golf cart drivers like unlicensed children pulling out of subdivisions is why MPD is cracking down. Even if it's a street legal vehicle, a child can be sighted, uh, the vehicle itself can be towed. And again, it creates an additional expense to the, uh, the owner of, of that, uh, that, that vehicle. Now, local golf cart dealers are getting an influx of customers to get their golf cart street legal. Rick Smith says so far he hasn't had too many people complain about it. Get a few, get a few people that have a complaint or two about it. You know, just don't want to do it or don't want to spend the money or that kind of thing. So what does it mean to have your golf cart street legal? You have to have mirrors on each side of the, of the vehicle. Then you have to have seat belts. The front and back has those, okay? And then you have to have what's called a deluxe light kit. It has a horn at the end of it, turn signals, and emergency flashers. And then we have to add stickers to it. This shows, this is an FTC sticker, just like on the inside of any vehicle. This sticker here is our sticker saying we brought it up to standards of street legal. In Mobile, Lisa Lebrignac, NBC 15 News.